The fight over the concealed carrying of guns is driving Chicago and Illinois down Division Street. We will begin living in the days like the wild, wild west of yesteryear, where everyone who walks upon the street and has a gun determines that they will now solve their issues by shooting one another. This is a fundamental, constitutionally protected civil right. The right to self-defense, the right to own a firearm. It's not a privilege to be meted out by bureaucratic you know, people. Illinois is the only state with a total ban on allowing gun owners to carry their weapons in public. But a federal court decision has thrown out that law, and now the Illinois legislature has a looming deadline to pass a concealed carry statute that's less restrictive. People start off at polar opposites, and when they start talking, they get even farther apart. Sheila Simon, the lieutenant governor of Illinois and the daughter of former Illinois senator and presidential candidate Paul Simon, feels the divisions are so stark that she organized a firearms working group to get legislators to just talk. Safety uh, from a rural Illinois perspective often involves, I feel safer if I have my firearm with me. Uh, and safety from an urban concern often involves, I feel safer if I know that there's a lot fewer firearms all around us. One of the legislators on Simon's working group is Chicago area lawyer Chris Welch. I agree with uh, the lobbyists from the NRA that the Second Amendment does confer a fundamental right to bear arms. Uh, and we, we all respect that right. But I think it's our charge to also balance that with public safety. That balance includes defining who will qualify for a concealed carry permit, screening out those with mental health issues, identifying where permit holders cannot carry concealed guns, and how much training will they have to take. Gun advocates focus on limiting those limitations. Opponents of this legislation keep saying, you can't carry here, you can't carry here, you can't carry. And by the time you're done drawing all those circles, you'll be lucky to walk down the sidewalk. Chicago's top cop personally heard the divisions over concealed carry from spectators after one of his key statements to legislators. But I want to be clear that there is no compelling evidence, despite what gun advocates say, to show that more guns makes people safer. In fact... There are lots of people in fear, uh, and that's one of the reasons why this is such a, uh, an emotional issue. In Chicago, this is John McCarthy reporting for the Lawyers.com channel.